Obadiah Genocide here uh, with another LOL shoutcast. Um, and this is an old game I had. I really enjoyed playing it. Um, I thought I'd uh, give you the highlights here. And the first one is right there. Our misfortune gets first blood on Renekton. And if you look at my health bar down at the bottom, I was playing Oriana. I almost gave it up. So it was, it was pretty close. So that was a little mistake on my part. But the problem is, after that, things start going bad for us. There, my lane partner, Tr uh, Trinomir, just died. And then Singe dies. Um, and things go bad for us for a while until our mid, Vladimir, does this. He cleans up after the top gets ganked and both killed, and he ends up getting a triple kill right here. He, he uh, takes Renekton out by himself after he took out Leeson and Ash. That was awesome. That kind of shifted the momentum. And right here, my Trindomir, my lane partner, goes right into a fight, and I have to follow him, getting the kill on um, Blitzcrank, and finally Swain as well, and I get a double kill out of that, which makes me happy. I mean, anytime I can get any type of multi-kill is a good thing. Swain comes right back and we kill him again. And um, there the momentum kind of stops and it, it shifts slightly back and forth. Uh, right here we get like a, a one for one deal where Singe dies but he also kills Renekton. Um, and the same thing happens here. It's a, it's a two for one so it's okay. We're still maintaining our momentum. I get... Um, both the kills again on Swain and Blitzcrank. And right here is where we get our first tower. We're able to get um, this tower. This is our third tower. Second tower. The second tower we killed uh, is already down. There's a small team fight right underneath, right in front of their tower. And again, Trindomir comes in, helps clean up. Uh, we get Renekton, and we're able to push this tower. We get three towers before they can even get one of ours which is really handy, demoralizes them, and again, we keep the momentum in our favor. Again, this is uh, this is done with LOL Replay, um, so if you are curious about malfunctioning health bars, it's the replay thing. They get their first tower right there. Um, two of our guys do something stupid right here. They tower dive and don't kill Lee Sin. Uh, it was really funny. They just... Oh, facepalm. Right here, they're, they're going to get their uh, second tower, I believe. Things uh, start going in their favor, and it's it's just you can't defend well. It was a really good game. I was going back and forth like this a lot. I lost track of my ball as Oriana, which you don't want to do, and I thought it was on me, and I tried to uh, ult, and it didn't work. Again, our team fights are just going awful for us. Uh, we're able to... Singe helps us, um, help us, helps us defend and push things back. We're always working really, really hard. Right here, um, where we see Lee Sin kind of signal uh, the start of a team fight. I come in and just about rape uh, Ash right there, and we start really hurting them. And this team fight goes really, really well for us, and this, again, dictates the pace of the next few minutes for us. We're able to push and keep them on their heels. Now, we try to chase Blitzcrank here. I don't think it works out, because uh, I think Swain, yep. Swain comes up right there and slows us down. Again, we're able to push the lane a little bit and um, keep things from going too bad for us. Great toss by Singe there, and we hurt Swain bad. And uh, again, keep them on the defensive and un un unable to push us. <laughs> I had a few of those uh, fail arrows from Ash, and I just love to see those. Another um, team fight starts going bad for us. They catch our misfortune out of position, um, and they stun Singed right there, and I try to run, I believe. I think I get out of here. Yeah. Uh, Vlad comes up to help, and we have to engage here. We end up killing Lee Sin, and Renekton has to run because his team didn't back him up. And so we're able to pull something good out of that team fight and uh, make it kind of even, although I get pulled there by Blitzcrank and <laughs> another fail arrow by Ash. <laughs> and it, it just, the team fights are pretty even. We get caught, or Trindomir, sorry, gets caught at Dragon here. And we can't do much of anything with this. Good, not a fail arrow by Ash. A good arrow by Ash gets rid of Misfortune. She can't do anything. I come in here realize I can't do anything, and I am in trouble. So I run out. Vlad comes. Try to help Vlad. Do a lot of damage there, but the rest of their team comes, and we can't do anything. Vlad decides to chase in. 
that's a bad idea. He gets killed. And I'm gonna die here pretty soon, yep. Oh no, I don't die. Amazing. Amazingly, I don't die. Singed comes in and deflects it. Right after that, they go to get Baron. And as we pop up, we're able to catch Swain way out of position after they get Baron and get rid of him. So that's that's really good for us. And we decide to push right now because one of them's down, even though four of them have the Baron buff, we decide we can try to to push in and punish them for that. So we're going towards mid. We're going to try to get this tower and get rid of as many people, get rid of as many buffs as we can. Kind of um, miscalculation on the grab there by, by this tank. Definitely did not want to grab the tank. He wants to grab the squishies. Trindamir goes down here soon. And uh, another arrow by Ash did okay. Not what they wanted to do. But we kept them from taking advantage of the Baron buff. Right here, uh, Renekton should go down pretty easily. Yep, there we go. And so, then now they only have three with the buff, and they weren't able to push at all, and the buff's gonna, gonna expire on them. We're able to get this tower right here pretty easily. I stake on the tower, because I am not a fan of chasing. Even though I've done it before, I am not a fan of chasing. Uh, Lee Sin gets caught out of position again, and it starts kind of a long team fight that ranges all over the map. We, we get him, we see Swain down by our tower, we come after him. Swain and Ash. Uh, Ash is able to get away. Swain kills Misfortune, but is, is killed in, in turn, and we decide to chase Ash. And here's one of the times it works out for me to chase. Usually it never, ever works out to chase. I hate chasing. But right here, if you notice on the minimap, um, Blitzcrank and Singed are going at it in, in the lane, and we're chasing Ash around them. It's kind of a weird decision, but it, it, it enables us to flank um, Renekton and Blitzcrank. Even though they kill Singed, we're able to get them out of the way. Uh, Ash uses her ult on me. I die. But this is where Trindamir decides, hey, look, I'm going to, you know, start doing good. And kills both of them right there and scores an ace. Uh, Trindamir just comes out of nowhere and starts destroying the rest of the team. Uh, Trindamir and Vlad push really, really well. Bad idea by Lee Sin again. He, the rest of his team isn't really... They're not up. And Trindamir almost dies there. I think... Yeah. Vlad goes down to um, Lee Sin right here. Trindamir comes up, and it's just amazing. He destroys him and gets another ace right there. So bad. And that this is where it's really funny. Swain's like, oh, I can clean this up. He baits them into the bush, hits him really hard, Misfortune helps him out, and he, Trindamir gets his third ace. And the momentum is firmly in our favor. Singe and I get rid of Ash, who's out of position right there. Lee Sin kind of tries to come down, gets sandwiched between a couple of our players, and it just keeps going worse and worse for them. Because Trindamir is ridiculous in this game. He has a Black Cleaver, a Bloodthirst, a Phantom Dancer, Lots of damage, lots of crit, and lots of attack speed. He gets an ace right under this turret right here. Just awesome. <laughs> so I was so happy to watch watch this as I was uh, respawning, unfortunately. Well, no, actually, I was I blue pilled. And they they push again. They push finally into their base, and they get that that fail arrow. <laughs> I have to go seals all the time. I love it so much. Um, this doesn't end well for us, though. We push really hard. We get two inhibitors, and that was really good, but we almost get aced. I posted this video, um, just this part of the video, on my channel, and it was hands down my favorite part of the game. I don't do some great juking, but I'm able to use Oriana's W to really confuse Blitz and Renekton. Uh, Blitz fail grab there. Renekton, they just can't catch up with me because the cooldown, I have cooldown reduction and it's not very short, or not very long anyway on my W, and I'm able to speed up and keep just barely ahead of them. And I'm saved by Blitz's failure to grab me. He should have used his knockup punch that um, really would have would have killed me outright, honestly. And here is what happens after that. They get pissed, they focus me immediately, which was their bad. They should have done some more against Trindamir, who 
just comes in. Oh, actually, he couldn't. He wasn't even there. Tryndamere comes in, mops up the rest of it, and wins the game for us. This was an awesome push on. They, they get pissed at me, kill me, and they're not able to to keep Tryndamere from doing this to two of their players. Swain was healing himself right now and just gets rocked by Tryndamere. Tryndamere chases after Lee Sin underneath the turret, gets rid of him, and just kind of slowly strolls out. Oh, I'm fine. Don't, don't bother me, turret. And just gets rid of the minions and pushes right to the end. That was that game. I had a lot of fun. I'm Obadiah Genocide. See you later.